think this is the one she's leaning towards. I mean, I only <laughs> worry. That Good for hiding, hiding her dinner, <laughs> hiding the mic. Okay, perfect. She's cute. Hi, Bobby. Yeah. There's a lot of people wow. up in here. Lots of cameras. Hi, Thank you for helping my daughter. <laughs> oh! Wow! I think I'm picking up a signal. <laughs> It's so wild how I've watched so many Vogue videos of like people I idolize getting ready and now men want suckers. <laughs> wow. This is the final look. I feel powerful. <laughs> I feel empowered. I feel so confident. I feel beautiful. Don't! You just did my makeup. I'm not about to cry. Y'all did a wonderful job. Look how damn good I look. Look at this. Look, look, show the team. Show the team. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, we're gonna blow your faces out. Look at this. Look at all these magicians. I love you, dude. I love all of you guys. This has been a real bonding experience. Can I get one? No one says it back. Excuse me, which way is the uh, Met Gala? This way, dude, this way. Oh, Refreshing. Oh. Brandon Maxwell is with her, the designer of the dress. Her eyelashes, I can see them from here. I can feel them from here. I can feel the wind from her eyelashes from here. We are starting off the night with the queen of camp, the camp counselor, Lady Gaga. She's defining camp for all of us right now. She's putting on her performance. She just removed a fuchsia outer jacket and now has a beautiful black gown. And although there is no sun out, she got an umbrella over her head, and I love that extraness. This is what camp is all about, man. Yes! This is Vogue's first 18. Oh, snap! Woo! Gaga just served us three looks. She just gave us a three course meal this evening. I am full. There is no need for me to go inside for the dinner. Look at her. She has a phone from the 90s, I believe, that she's currently answering. She's also rocking sunglasses. It's not sunny outside, I love that. She's literally answering a business call on the carpet. Oh, they got the hairspray going on. <laughs> yes, queen. She been doing squats, her little booty is popping right now. Oh. Dude, the level of extra is giving me life. <laughs> I'm sorry, I just had a rebirth. Um, mm. Somebody in the audience just asked, Anna, how is anybody gonna follow this? And Anna said, ah, they should just go home. <laughs> Literally, Met Gala 2019 is going to be Anna Wintour and Lady Gaga just sitting across the table from each other eating. That's it. And you. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'll go inside, too. No, I'll be serving them water. Like, can I get you anything? Skinny margarita? Okay. Ah! Remember that three-course meal we got served earlier? Yeah, this is dessert. It's so tasty. Look at her climbing up the stairs. Yes. Yes. Oh, my God. Yes, my queen! <laughs> yes! If there isn't a documentary on Netflix about this, I'm gonna be pissed. Is it Mary Poppins themed? Is it? Is she promoting the movie for free? I don't know, but I love it! She literally, like, got ready on the carpet three times. Is she not coming to the Met Gala for the next three years because she just served three different looks? I don't know. Oh, you're not gonna reach my telephone up in the club and up and you're not gonna reach my telephone. She's literally answering a business call on the carpet. She's doing deals. She's doing brand deals right now. I think that's fake paparazzi around her that she hired outside of the hundreds of paparazzi here tonight. Dude, the level of extra is giving me life. I'm sorry, I just had a rebirth. Um, excuse me. Oh, oh, she just hung up on whoever that was. Oh, she just fired someone, I think. She's going back down, man. My heels hurt. I gotta. Oh, there's nothing under that, right? Wow. Come here, come here. Hello, come here. No. Ah, she 
she just headed inside. She's got to go eat now or, you know, put on her five layers of dresses. Um, thank you, Lady Gaga, for your presence. Woo. This Met Gala is off to a good start. <laughs> wow. Wow. Good luck getting up the stairs with that. I'm excited to see his core strength and balance. Whoa, he is spreading his wings. Look at you. Yeah, hello. I got wingspan over yes, here. Yes, Speaking yes. of wings, we got Billy Porter with a side of wings tonight. Let me yes, see that. Honey. Oh. Yes. Hey, Let me hey. get the wingspan. Wow, Kacha. Kapam. Shahoo. <laughs> you literally just drained my bank account. That's what you just did. <laughs> Your Oscars outfit was absolutely incredible and Thank sparked you. such a wonderful conversation. Do you think you topped it tonight? I'm not trying to top any ah. day. I'm just trying to show up and be appropriate for the moment. Well, you look absolutely <laughs> more than appropriate. You look Thank wonderful. You. How would you describe camp and how is it so intertwined in society today? Well, the kids call it extra. Yeah. <laughs> for many, many years, it's been uh, used as a pejorative. And I think when you have something like this, you know, it brings the respect back right. to something that is high, high art, mm. high craft. You know, I've, I've, I've built a career on playing campy characters. Yeah. You know, I have a career, I have this life because of that. Tell me about your look and your performance tonight. How, how long did it take to plan that and coordinate that? Well, the, the look came because Ryan Murphy said to me, you should go as uh, Diana Ross, all five looks from the mahogany montage. <laughs> I was like, bitch, I don't want to work that hard. <laughs> um, but I got the idea for the Egyptian look. That was yes. the one that stuck out to me. And then we went to the blondes. And go. Cleopatra? Cleopatra, there yes. Go. You know, I wanted something that was positive. I wanted something that was about, you know, forward motion, upward motion. You know. That's what we want for society, right? Yes, yes. Come on, let's grow. Yeah, let's yeah, prosper. Yeah. Well, yeah. you look absolutely wonderful. Thank I hope you, you enjoy your amazing match. Thank, thank you for thank blessing you. the carpet. <laughs> yes, thank you so sir. much. Some Billy Porter served up with wings on the side. That sounds like a good meal tonight. You a walking sculpture, too. Come on over here. We can't really stand by each other. <laughs> we can't. We can't. What do you got Keep in there? Keep this distance. Girl, I should have had snacks and See, gum. Sean Mendez is only 20, so I kept tequila in here just for him. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I don't give alcohol to minors. <laughs> Done. I should have had gum and like yeah, asked for five see, stars. Like, I was walking out and I realized Liam had put his phone in <laughs> this way. like it's a real pocket. It's because he's Australian. He thinks it's like a Joey pouch or something. Yeah, but go. this is his first Met, so he doesn't yeah. know how it goes. How's, how's it going? How's his first Met going? It's going good. We're here with yeah. St. Laurent and I'm just happy to represent them. I think yes. they do camp in such a fierce kind of yeah. punk rock kind of way. And yeah. it's obviously camp is about being authentic. And I think right yeah. now St. Laurent is what makes me feel the most myself. That's right. And what's the most extravagant thing you say you would have ever done? Done. The most extravagant thing? Yeah, extravagant. My life is pretty yeah, extravagant. Right. You know, yeah, my right. favorite time of the year is Met Ball. It's like a reunion with all your friends and it starts feeling like family, but yeah. I'm also like, I'm a big looky loo. So I love to watch and kind of, you know, judge and <laughs> vote on what my favorite thing is anyone's worn. And of course, I love Gaga laying on the stairs and right. her full extra. Right, I live for go. it. There's like no rules this year because camp is about being big, being bold, yeah, being exactly. brave, right? Yeah. How would you define camp? And I think it's being authentic, you know, and but I'm pretty sure camp actually translates to just wearing kind of the most outrageous thing you can find. Yeah, yeah. there you go, there you go. And this is your first met as a married couple. How's it feel? It feels good. I've always been here solo, so it's I wore higher heels because I had someone <laughs> to hold me this time. There you go. What else is going to end up in that pocket tonight? We'll see. Hopefully, uh, you know, a couple friends on the way to the after party. I have a feeling Rita Ora will be in here at some point. <laughs> you look amazing Thank tonight. You so Thank you so much. I can't wait to see you on our inside. You. You're genius for being on the platform. Yeah, straight up. I'm on this platform. Boop. That's how tall I really am. Thank you, Miley. Oh, uh, uh, she got the horses in the back. <laughs> you look incredible. Describe Thank to you. me your look tonight. You look uh, well, I'm rocking the Michael Kors yes. collection here. Course, I'm calling it Pimparella, aka Camparella. Yo, camp is like larger than life, big, extravagant. Is this the most extravagant moment for you? Uh, no, I've had other extravagant moments, <laughs> but this is the most expensive extravagant Yo, moment. Yo, you look expensive. Yes. That's a strong bank account, yeah, I yeah, smell. That's, yeah, yeah, that's, that's good credit. There you go. <laughs> that's amazing. What, what can you expect inside for your second Met? I'm expecting a few good drinks, yeah. uh, wonderful art collections, really great conversation with yeah. some friends. And if the food is not what it what I need it to be, I went ahead and I brought some chicken. You feel Shut me? Shut up! 
Yo, we just got the title of this video. I brought chicken. Tiffany Addish brought fried chicken in her purse. I got chicken in my bag. Swag. <laughs> That's real pimp stuff. Forget that. You forgot the hot sauce, though. No, that's hot sauce. Don't worry about that. <laughs> she ready. There we go. OK, well, you have just fulfilled me. I'm full. I don't even need dinner anymore. You look damn <laughs> Thank good. You look scrumptious. Save a piece of chicken for me, though, OK? I will. I will. I will. Yeah. I will. OK, we got hairstyles coming up. Oh, my god. Come to Papa. Come to Papa. Oh, god, you look so good. Baby, you light up the mat like nobody else. How you doing, Mr. Harry? Nice to see you. Welcome to your Pleasure. first mat, and you're it a co-chair. How does it feel? Am. It's an honor. It's, yeah. Uh, yeah, it's nice to be here. It's wonderful. So, you look amazing. Please tell me about your look you, tonight. Thank so you. Thank you. Thank it's, you. Uh, it's Gucci. Yeah, that's right. It's Gucci. And uh, it's pretty camp. What does camp mean to you? How would you define camp? Um, to me, I mean, I think it's about enjoyment and yeah. about fun. No judgment and um, right. I don't know, having fun with clothes. I think fashion is supposed to be fun. So yeah, and that's who you are. That's what it's all. And I think it's a good time for that right now as well. People being who they are. So, so. Now you are a style icon for so many. Who's Harry Styles' style icon? Uh, this guy. Right here, Alessandro oh. Michel, please come on in. Yeah. Welcome back. Oh, thank you, thank yes. you. It's a pleasure, yes, as please. always. And I'm coming with a friend, you know? <laughs> right. So it's always beautiful to go to a party with a friend. Yeah, and you are so known for taking Gucci and, and, and making it into such whimsical, fantastical fashion. How would you define camp tonight? Um, freedom, yeah. personality. I mean, a little touch of craziness, just to, you know? Yeah. A young guy must be a little bit crazy. That's right. I'm not anymore young, but I feel it. Hey, you're young at heart. Oh, oh we got right. nails tonight? Oh, yeah, we always have nails. We always a have nails, time, right? Yeah. Hey, you nailed the look to light, man. You, you nailed the look. Have a Gucci night, y'all. I can breathe again. Oh. OK. Come on in. We've got Mr. 21 Savage arriving at his first mat. How you feeling, man? I'm high, I'm good. The teeth match the suit. <laughs> That's right. How you feeling? You wearing Dapper Dan? Yeah, Dapper Dan. I just let him do his magic. Yeah. For sure. You worked his magic and you combined it with yours? Yeah, for sure. That's for right. Sure. So what can you expect inside the mat for your first time? I don't know. That I'm trying to see what's going on. Yeah. yeah. You think it's good food? I don't know. We're going to see. <laughs> what's your favorite food? What do you hope Anna cooked up? Fried chicken. There we go. There we go. So what would you define as camp? I don't know. Like woods? <laughs> I don't know. I thought I was going to dress up as a Girl Scout. I thought I was going to dress up as a Thin Mint. Right. <laughs> yeah. Well, you look good, man. Have an amazing mint. It's already good so far, right? Me too, yeah. Yes, Thank you. I'll see you in time, man. Yeah, take care. 21 Savage, man. He's, he's so confused. He's like, I don't know what to expect from the Met. We'll find out, I guess. Who's Hannah? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Tell me about your look tonight. You look wonderful, man. Thank you. So do you, obviously. Yeah. Um, I'm wearing Jean Paul Gaultier. Yeah. Went for some Tinkerbell vibes tonight. You straight up look like Tinkerbell. That's okay, right, girl. Tinkerbell. If you need your Peter Pan, I got Hello, some pixie camp. dust. I am here. Yes. So, what does camp mean to you? You know, that's a really interesting question. I think it's. First of all, I think it's all about finding what makes you you and running with that in excess. It's all about being playful and going overboard, over the top. I mean, this is like the like to me the perfect first Met Gala theme because it's such a fun theme. Like I could do whatever I wanted, and as long as it's excessive, like it works. Yeah. And not gaudy and over like and cheesy, but like ref not refined either. Like chic yeah. but excessive. That was beautiful. Did you read Susan Sontag's uh, notes on camp? Maybe. <laughs> She did her research before she came to her Maybe first mat. That's right, that's right. Fix the bangs. There you go. So, so what was the inspiration behind Tinkerbell? Why Tinkerbell tonight? It wasn't even that I wanted to look like Tinkerbell. It's just yeah. when, you know when you try on the perfect outfit and you're like, this is it? This is the one. I tried on five and then I tried this on and I was like, okay, it's there it. Goes. And I was like scared because I don't usually wear short dresses and it's yeah. a lot of real estate taking up. You don't I'm wear short dresses with those legs. No. <laughs> well, you look wonderful, dude. What, what, what can you expect inside for your first mat? I don't know. What can I expect? You tell me. You. This is your second time, right? You know more than I do. Just get a to-go box because it's a lot of food. Yeah. Is yeah, it yeah. actually? No, not wow, really. You not get really. one chicken breast. I'm excited to see everybody. Yeah. What a fun first the whole time. Cast is here. Yeah. The whole, like, pretty much the whole cast of Riverdale is here. Riverdale is here, yeah. and I haven't seen anybody yet. Yeah. Have they arrived yet? Not none. They didn't okay. come up to me. <laughs> well, you would know better than I would. Yay. They're, they're probably on their way. Are you gonna have a reunion inside? Yes, we are. I'm yeah. so excited. Oh, good. Well, you look wonderful tonight. Thank Go and enjoy the Met, girl. Get on in there. I love you. Of course, love you too. Have so much fun. Dang, look at that. She got shaped. 
Yeah. What up? <laughs> you look amazing. You got to stand right here. What's up, man? You got me falling off here. I know, I know. Yeah. You've been around the world recently, man. You've been on tour. Yeah. How's that going? Amazing. Really yeah. so fun. Honestly, it's a, it's a dream life, and I couldn't be there more thankful. Go. Yeah. All around the world. But you're here tonight, and here who tonight. are you wearing? I'm wearing Saint Laurent. I have some gold in my hair, which is crazy for me. You know that I, this 14 karat magic. This is 14 karat magic in my hair right now. <laughs> also, Jared Leto's walking around with a head. Have you oh, seen yeah, that? I saw that. The Gucci yeah. head. It's freaking me out. You <laughs> I'm doing everything in my power to stay there you far, go. far you think, away. You think he's going to walk home with that tonight or someone's going to take it? Are you going to take it? I, I'm going to try and take it. Taking it to go box with yeah, dinner? I'm going to try and get him to sign the forehead and give it to me. Well, what do you think is camp? And how is your outfit camp tonight? I don't know. I honestly, I don't know how to explain that to you. Really, truly, right? that's a very hard thing to explain. Is that what everybody's saying? Yeah, it, no, it's hard to define. Yeah, honestly, I was like, when someone was like, it's camp, I'm like, camping gear, like tents and stuff. Like, I'm about to come dressed up as the Boy Scout from Up. Yeah, I was literally, my, like, my stylist was like, all right, so we're going to go camping gear. I'm like, all right, this will be great. Are you excited for your second match? Yeah, I am. Yeah. It's relaxed, and I feel right? I feel way more calm this time. Well, you look amazing tonight. Thank you, so do you, you gotta save me a seat inside there, okay? Okay, okay cool. You. And dance too, right? Dance, dance. We're too. dancing. I'll see you. I don't know. He sauces, Bye. but I'll see you. <gasps> yep, yep. Didn't see that coming. You know, we're friends, and it's casual, but like I'm such a stand still. <gasps> okay, yep. I let it all out. What's up? How you doing? <laughs> you wanna come on over here? Yeah, I just wanna be a kiss for you. Whoop, girl, look at all these jewels. Yes. Welcome to the carpet, Miss Expensive. How you doing? <laughs> you know, good. Just in Moschino, yes. as always, yes, king of yes. camp. Yes. Little booty cheeks sticking out back there. They go them little hips. Them little hips. Just She's there. Do. She's there. there. You go. What was the inspiration for tonight? I think you know, Jeremy. Just it's a big group of us, so he is obviously the king of camp, and he, yes. you know, decided to put us all in the looks that fit us best and I think this one fit me the best. A lot yes. of diamonds, a lot of skin. So how would you define camp? People are like, how do I define camp tonight? Is it a tent? Huh? Camp is extravagant. Camp is fun. Camp is everything fun about fashion that we love. It's such a regal event that yeah. the Met Ball. So to be able to come here and really show off our fun side and you know wear things we wouldn't usually wear, yeah. it's just fun. If you had to give an outfit to your spirit, is this what your spirit would wear? My spirit would be naked, but <laughs> yes, this diamonds work too. It would be a different video if it was naked. There we go. Who do you think is performing tonight? I have literally no, 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 no idea. I'm Usually I'm like, you know, in the loop. I'm really not in the loop this year. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I love a good surprise though. You yeah, ready for that? Too. Me too. Yeah. You look wonderful. Thank you. I see you. Go ahead and head on in, mama. Oh, you let me get up. Thanks Thank for coming you. to say hi. Hi. Look at this dress. Yeah. <laughs> Slide on out. Boom. Oh, she looks so good. Little cutouts. Dang. Got a little sneak peek of the booty. Still looking. Still looking. Yes. I gotta get in and come How you doing? I'm good. Yo, what's up? You want my platform? Do I want it? Damn. Yeah. <laughs> no, look real small. Miss Cara, Miss Cara, describe the look I to me a tonight. Too, honey. There you go. Yeah. There you go. Talk to it. Use that platform. Yeah. So what you got going on tonight? You went grocery shopping. You got some bananas. I got some eggs. Bananas. <laughs> Cheap. There you go. Dentistry. Ow. <laughs> so I'm wearing uh, Dior and some custom pieces. Well, it looks absolutely amazing. Thank What's you. the inspiration behind it? Pain. Pain. <laughs> <I'm> joking. <laughs> Obviously camp. Camp all the way. Camping all day. That's what yes. we do here. Yeah. Awesome. And how would you define camp? I would define camp as expression of your most outrageous. Yes. Yeah. Is this your most outrageous look to date? Oh, nearly. I'd say 5%. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. 5%. I like the highlighter across. That's nice. Thank you. Can we get a full turn real quick? You look wonderful. There we go. Bow. Bow. There we go. I want to see it from the back. Bang, bang. I like the crystallized pastes, too. You look gorgeous. Yo, like thank you. I'm gonna thank you. Yo, could you, you like straight up could with that tiny ass waist. I'm just saying. Just saying. Welcome to the Met, your first Met. I know, it's yeah. so exciting. Yeah. How does it feel to be here with each other? It's really energetic yeah. and I feel supported, yeah. which is nice. Feels good, feels good. Yeah. <laughs> Almost the whole cast of Riverdale up in here. I know. Yeah. You guys look amazing. Please describe to me your look. Um, this is Preble Garung, yes. inspired by the quote in Susan Sontag's essay about um, camp is a woman dressed in three million feathers or something. Yes. Um, so yeah, three million and one. Yeah, three million and one feathers over here, Ooh. and a big bow in the back. Look at that big bow. Yeah, <laughs> back there. There you go. <laughs> like Cinderella, but a yellow too. Oh, I know. There you go. Man, y'all are glowing. Thank you. I need to drink the water you're drinking. Y'all look healthy <laughs> and nourished. Let's go. Thank so you. what can we expect inside from your first met? What do you think's in there? I don't know. I just want to make some new friends. There you go. Yeah, food, meet some people. Hopefully there's food. Food, in there. yeah. food. That yeah. would be yeah. great. And how would you define define camp? People have had a tough time uh, creating a definition for what camp is because it almost like doesn't have a definition. Yeah. Yeah. What would you say your definition would be? Sleeping bags, tents, <laughs> campfire, <laughs> s'mores. Girl Scout cookies. Yeah. Come and get your cookies. cookies. Yeah. Uh, theatrical, performative, I think. Um, in a way, playing a character. I think for, that's how I perceive it. 
Yeah. Yeah. That's beautiful. And who is the character that you're channeling tonight? Uh, I feel like I'm a little bit like I'm Brazilian, so this kind of feels like Carnaval to me, like a little bit like samba dancing with feathers yes. and like extravagant makeup. Yes. Yeah, I don't know. There you go. Can we expect yeah. some dancing tonight? Maybe. We'll see. This is a great dress to yeah. twerk in. <laughs> the Brazilian booty back there. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Well, thank you guys so yeah. much. I hope you guys have a wonderful first thank night. Thank you. Enjoy thank it, y'all. Have you. a good one. That is a beautiful couple. Oh my God, I would love to adopt their babies. Oh, Miss Celine the Queen. May I bow in your presence? Hello, Miss Celine Dion. Hello. How are you? I'm wonderful. I'm so honored to be here. Oh, I'm honored to be speaking with you tonight. Please tell me about your wonderful look. Well, I am wearing Oscar de la Renta, Noel Stewart for the headpiece. Because I thought I was going to camp. <laughs> I got confused. You said, I, I, thought I brought I was... my pillow <laughs> and my one-piece pajama. You can pitch a tent inside. And then they said, oh, we're going to show you, girl, what camp is all about. Yes. Right. And I'm so, I'm very honored. It's my second experience at the Met. Yes. But this time, I have to admit that the fact that they trusted me and that they asked me to in, be involved in the process of making this happen. I mean, who doesn't want to look? Yes, like look at that beadwork. Look at that wingspan. I don't want to have a pajama tonight. <laughs> I don't want you to have one either. I, I? I want to wake up like this tomorrow. <laughs> this year, I'm accompanied by, you know, please, please come. Come, come. Please. How are you? Very They're good. How are you? They're, I'm so fantastic. They're responsible for making this happen. Oh. They trusted me. The Zickfield Girl was the inspiration. It's a film uh, that we were inspired by, and we thought it was a perfect marriage of Celine's aesthetic and life with uh, our Oscar de la Renta's uh, aesthetic as well. Thank you. Thank you very much, you all. Have a wonderful Met. Thank you, thank you. Oh, man, stunning. Girl, I'm blinded. You look wonderful. Thank you very much. Oh my God, her little antennas tickled me at the very end. I just got tickled by Celine Dion. Did you see that? That was so cool. My heart will go on. How's it going? Good. You look absolutely amazing. Thank you. You're expecting your fourth child. Yes, yes, yes. I know. I heard there was rumors he was coming today, but not happening. Not happening. Oh, man. Well, I wouldn't be here. I'd have to get on a plane real quick. Yeah, well, you look absolutely wonderful. Please describe Thank to you. me your look tonight. Yes, I am wearing um, Mr. Mugler. He hasn't designed for the House of Terry Mugler in 20 years. So he had this vision of me as a California girl getting out of the ocean in, oh. in L.A. or, you know, in Malibu and yeah. onto the red carpet. You're so all clicked. It makes so much sense. It's like the wet yeah. So it's like a wet, yeah, that's what it's called, the wet look. So it's a T-shirt, just kind of straight out of the ocean. So who would you say your style icon is tonight? Who are you looking forward to seeing the looks tonight? Um, I mean, I heard a rumor Cher is going to be here. She's always my fashion icon. Yeah. I'd say, you know, Naomi is always my fashion icon. I love her hair and makeup looks always, always looks flawless. Um, and then I love all the classic, you know, movie stars. But I'd say Sharon, if I see her tonight, yeah. I'm going to be so excited. My Armenian sister. <laughs> and so would you say that Cher is a, an inventor of the camp too? Absolutely. Yeah. Cher and Bob Mackie, I mean, they're it. They're everything. How would you uh, define camp? If you could give it a definition. People have struggled to give it a definition tonight. It seems like there's not one. I would say Manfred Terry Mugler is the go. definition of camp. Done and done. Yeah. <laughs> well spoken, Miss Lawyer. How's the studying going? <laughs> it's good. It's hard. It's good? It's yeah. definitely hard. Yeah, I've had to give up some sacrifices in order to do that. So I haven't had a beauty treatment or anything for myself in about seven months and so I had to do all that prep for the Met and I was like I forgot what this is like because <laughs> I've you know traded my my reading and studying instead of my you know facials so I think you need it you can save some money on it you don't need it you look good girl you look wonderful you. brains and beauty thank you well thank you for blessing the carpet oh my god of course yes. thank you see is that this is Beaumont I love it oh, I got so excited I when they put it. me in this I was like look yeah. at me I'm like a Kardashian <laughs> or something look at me also thank you for the Sunday That's services amazing. Bless. I'm very thankful for them. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. I don't want to Thank you. Yes, look back at it. Look back at it. <laughs> you know how I usually have an ending line? I don't got one. I'm good. I'm good. Damn, I'm good at my job. Yes, my king and queen of the evening. What's up? What's up? How you doing? It's the first met since marriage, yeah? Yes, it is. How's it, it is. feel? It's great. It's just like the first time, but this time we're married. <laughs> there you go. There you go. No, we were a lot more awkward the first time. It was yeah. like, yeah. you know, like 
All right, what is this like? So you guys met at the Met for the very first time in 2017? Kind of. We met around the Met, but our first time walking any kind of red carpet together was the Met. Yeah. Well, so y'all were rocking Ralph Lauren the first time. What are we rocking now? Y'all look amazing. We're in Dior tonight, Dior and Chopin. But what was the inspiration behind the looks tonight? Uh, it was a few things. Uh, the camp idea as a whole lets you kind of do whatever you want. But Louis XIV was a big one for us both. Um, and just playing into that, that sense of not taking yourself too seriously, having some fun with it. Uh, we like spending time together. Uh, and to get to spend time together looking this outrageous is perfect. Yeah. I love the incorporation of a bindi too. Thank you. I do love my bindi. Thank yeah, you. you. It's celebrating the culture, right? It is. I mean, I always try and find something which defines who I am, which is an amalgamation of the East and the West. So this year it's my bindi. Yes, there you go. <laughs> Would you say that this is your most extravagant moment, or was it the wedding? Oh, well. I mean, I did have a 75 foot train. So. <laughs> this is tied, I think. Is it tied? It's tied. It's tied. Y'all look wonderful. And what's on your camp playlist? Was it Sucker? Was that on the playlist? Of course. Of course, right? Obviously. Cool. There you go. Cool. cool. <laughs> well, y'all look absolutely stunning. Thank so you for blinding me. <laughs> Thank you for blinding me with the beauty. And I hope y'all enjoy your Met together. Thank you. Yes, happy anniversary, technically. There you go. Yeah. There you go. It is. It is. Look at that. It's like our third year anniversary. Oh, beautiful. beautiful. Oh, we have. Yes! <laughs> That's right. That's right. Panka Chopra, Nick Jonas, kiss at their anniversary at the Met. Whoa! I love that. Let me write that title. Let me upload that video. Hold on. Let me edit this. Yeah, you stay there. I'll stay down here. There you go. <laughs> we'll be the same size then. Yeah, yeah. This is my real height. This is my oh real my height. goodness. <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness. I'm down here. How you doing? I'm good. I'm actually going to DJ a little bit later, which will be real fun. I heard that. That's yeah. why I showed up tonight, because I heard your DJ. You, you better, you're going to get soaking wet, I'll tell you that much. Oh. With what? Because I'm all thriller, no filler. There you go. It's hit, nothing but hits. So please, you look amazing tonight. Please describe the inspiration behind well, your look. Well, Zaldi, who has been doing my costumes for the past 25 years or so, did this, and uh, I'm very happy. So many people have said that you're their camp icon for tonight. Who is your camp icon? Well, John Waters and Divine and that whole movement right there. But you know, all of the my tribe, I knew how to look for them because of Monty Python's Flying Circus. When I was a kid, I used to watch that. So I have always enjoyed people who don't take life too seriously. Right. What else should we not take too seriously? Well, you know, the only, I'll tell you what you should take seriously is love and kindness. That's right. That's the message tonight. Well, thank you so, thank you so, so much. much. You look absolutely wonderful. Oh, and the feathers, too. They're blowing in the wind. Yes. Go tickle somebody with that inside. There you go. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Hello, Miss Haley Bieber. How you doing? Name change since last year. Yeah. <laughs> Welcome back. How's it going? So good. So good. And yeah. hello, Mr. Alexander Wang. How are you? How are you? Good to see you. So you look good. amazing. Thank you very much. <laughs> but how's it going tonight for you? Everything is so good. I'm really excited to be here. This is my yeah. fifth Met. I have the best day. Oh, I'm so honored. Yeah. She's gorgeous. Well, wonderful. So tell me, what was the inspiration behind tonight's look? We wanted to show this duality, something super sweet and demure with a little bit of another, you know, a little, a little bit sexy in the back, yeah. yeah. You mean like Betty Cooper vibes? Oh, yeah, look at there that. There we go. Oh, can we please get a shot of the back, girl? Look at that back. Oh, snap. You look good. You look good. I love that. So camp is defined as being extravagant, sometimes too much. And too much is the good thing, yeah? Yeah. Having yeah, fun. Please. It's about having that. fun. Yeah. Having fun on your own terms. That's how we define it today. What's really cool about this theme is that everybody has their own idea of what is over the top for them. And that's what I think is so cool. There's probably so many different looks, so many different vibes tonight. So. There you go. Well, y'all look amazing. You. Yes, have a wonderful night, y'all. You, you too. Love. Take care, take care. Oh wait, where your pants at, Alexander? What? Hold on. Whoa, what? He is that? But dazzled boxers. Box, your crystal yes. boxers. Yes. Yo, oh, it's oh, Aquafina. Yeah. You look so good right now. <laughs> How's your first Met going, you guys? It's going great. I got like I got the best date ever. Yes. Joseph Altazara made this beautiful dress. She looks gorgeous. Um, yeah, so I, I, just, I can't believe I'm here. This is so cool. <laughs> so tell me, what's the inspiration behind your dress tonight? Uh, well, it was sort of inspired by The Wizard of Oz and like the good witch Glinda um, and just like the queer roots of, 
of camp and I think camp is really fun and Aquafina is really fun and we just sort of that all is true I concur I yeah. am fun I'm a good date I told him I told him I might start yelling later no no I won't I won't He's, he, I actually scared him when I said that though. Yeah. please do please do you think you think anything that happened in Ocean's Day will happen inside there tonight I, I hope not because that was very it was a very complicated uh, heist yeah I, I hope tonight just goes smooth and, there we go yeah there we go. congratulations tonight dude good to see you yeah <laughs> Team player Aquafina, dude. This is why I don't drink Dasani. Yeah, forget that. I only drink Aquafina now. Yes. We got Lily Singh. We got Lily Singh being what pulled up here. Girl, what's up, what's up, what's up baby? How you doing? They let us in. They let us in. <laughs> Yo, we represent the hey, community. Hey. I just talked to James, too. We out oh, here. Oh, I know. He looks fabulous. He looks wonderful. You look fabulous. Look Thank at you. you. Work. You yes. Tell me, please describe your outfit to me. Yes. This is Moschino. Yes. And since uh, my name is Lily and people always spell it wrong anyways, I figured I'd dress like a Lily. Why not? Yeah. <laughs> so tell me, you, you you came up with the idea of the outfit or how did well, you? Well, no. Change? Jeremy Scott is great. So Jeremy Scott was like, I want you to be comfortable. I want you to feel your best self. Yes. And he really helped me put this vision together. Um, and then I said my hair, I obviously have long hair. I'm like, let's make it a little longer. There you go. Why not? Did you extend it? You extended it even more. No one will know. They, you would believe this is my real hair, wouldn't you? I thought, no, I thought you could grow that. You can literally do 100%, anything. All mine, 100% real. Yeah. So what do you expect out of your first Met tonight? Um, I expect a lot of good food. I expect yeah. a lot of good drinks. But so far, just seeing all these fabulous outfits, oh, everyone here looks amazing. Right? And the vibes are so good. Exactly. Mm -hmm. what, the culture is being represented tonight. Like, mm -hmm. so many different backgrounds are being represented 100%. tonight. What are, you, what are you standing for tonight? Tonight, I'm standing for the colored people. Yes. I'm also standing for the digital space. There we and go. also, just I'm a girl from Scarborough, Toronto, Canada that never thought she would make it to the Met Gala. And here I am. So I'm about to get inside and get ratchet there you go. on behalf of my city. There you go. <laughs> go ahead. Go show them what it's all I'm about inside. See I'll inside. see you inside. I'll see you inside. Ooh, she looks so good. She literally like just popped up from a garden like a daisy. Excuse me, like a lily, like a lily sing. What's up, James? You look incredible. Yeah, don't touch me, but I love you. Don't touch me, but I love you. So tell me about your look tonight. Who designed this? This is Alexander Wang, full safety pin top, a good silk bottom, and a good high heel boot too. Very mixed with like Alexander, but also me at the same time. I feel like so good. No, you are king of extravagance. Would you say that this is the most extravagant moment for you? Probably. This is like a lot of things that I would never normally feel comfortable in. I'm not the most body conscious, so the fact that I'm like shirtless under this isn't like horrifying. And I also like never wear black on my eyes, so this is just like a lot of things that are outside of my comfort zone. But I feel like that's exactly what camp is. This is new, new, new for you. It's your first Met too. It is. Who are your camp icons, or who are you excited to meet tonight? Lady Gaga. Yeah. She's just like everything in my eyes. She's so beautiful. I already saw her like four wardrobe changes earlier. So like I cannot wait to just like witness it all in person. I feel like this theme was made for you. Like you're bigger than life. You're you're too much. That's that's what you that's what camp is. You Thank ready? You, go go get on inside. Thanks go go, go save me as a, a seat, okay? I will. All right. Love you the most. I love you too, babe. You look so good. Look at that. Whole thing made out of safety pins. Look, he went to the craft store right before this and put all that together. He looked damn good. Mm. For real, his nipples bleeding though. Happy boy.